Although the Khitan still demand periodic tributes, we have pushed them back to the Yellow River. Fortunately, their occupation of Kaifeng was not destructive, and the city has already recovered. Having reviewed the results of the most recent examinations, the Emperor has chosen you to oversee the future development of Kaifeng. He expects it to soon become a cultural center unsurpassed in the world. Return to the classical teachings of Confucius and ensure that all learned people study his ways. Respect to the animals of the land. The emperor has set aside his own palace grounds as a park for creatures from all over China. Fill the park with at least six exotic species. In science and technology, our achievements grow more impressive each day. Our emperor's collection of scholarly books and encyclopedias includes 80,000 volumes. Wonderful devices such as the compass, abacus, and spinning wheel can be found all over our city. Su Song has drawn up amazing plans for an astronomical clock tower. Please help him achieve his goal. Finally, a new threat, the Sha Sha Empire is rising in the West. Our continued policy of appeasement of our enemies with the riches of our land should keep them at bay as it has the Khitan. Good luck, wise governor. You are presiding over the greatest city in the world, unsurpassed in its culture. Do not disappoint the Emperor.
Feng into a shining beacon for the world to see all of the glories of the Song Dynasty. Nowhere in the world is there a city such as Kaifeng. Only here is scholarship so highly respected. Only in Kaifeng do the sciences and the arts reign supreme. Even the beasts of the land, sea, and air occupy a special place near and dear to our emperor's heart. 